is day four on the no vote, no voice uh, bus and we are in Falmer at Sussex University campus who have been so lovely and uh, allowed us to come in and make sure that they, their students are registered to vote and they have a voice. We just walked past the bus and decided to pop in. It's fantastic uh, that you guys are here because voter registration is a huge issue for young people. Uh, there have been changes in the electoral registration law which made it more difficult for young people to register to vote and to have their voices heard and uh, it's so great that you guys are here doing this. I think this is a great initiative, I think it's a great thing that you guys are doing. I don't understand why you wouldn't want to vote and, change, and just try and change things. <laughs> Russell Brand, shut up! <laughs> so we just went in the bus and filled out my registering to vote so I will be voting in May on the 7th. I feel like the, the whole change in the registry has made a lot of people fall off the register and so they don't know that they're not allowed to vote so come um, voting day you know they might try to but they're actually they're not they can't they won't be able to. It is hard to understand politics but it is important to get all voices heard from all different ranges of ages as well because a lot of politics affects students like particularly and we're the future so yeah. <laughs> first time I voted before in the European elections no, no vote no voice I think if people have got well, there's a purpose to vote I think you know talk to people and they'll you can engage with them no vote no voice yeah I think that people should vote because if you don't vote then you really have no say in what's going on in the country and you have no right to complain about it if you haven't in the first place even voted about it if you have the opportunity to vote then you should really don't just waste your vote you can't complain about anything then if you're not going to change it. It's definitely worth paying attention to. It rules your life, really. Yeah. It's... If you vote, you can dictate who gets to apply what rules to your life. Oh, it really annoys me. You know, other countries they don't even get like people are, like taking their rights away from, and it's so easy here to vote. And, yeah. <laughs> no vote, no voice. <laughs> no matter what. Yeah, your views are, it's still important that you exercise them. Uh, some people say, what's the point? But a growing number who I've spoken to have said, oh no, I haven't, but I'm going to. No vote, no voice. I would say they're very interesting I would, politics. I, mean, I would say we're a great example of people who are really interested yeah. in politics. It's good, because like, the Conservative Party tried to take out the teenage vote, or like tried to make it harder for the teenage to vote. So this is brilliant, like coming to university and getting people to vote. The young people are the people that are going to change politics in my eyes, in like the future. So yeah, I'm 19 and it will be my first general election. No vote, no voice. Registered to vote. 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 And what would you say to... Voting. <laughs> What's not to love? I mean, voting's fun. Yeah. No vote, no voice. <laughs> Council will contact you okay. to, just for proof of your identity. Okay. Um, I think the voting rights for voters is really important to make a little change to the government. You vote, your vote is to represent your voice in a circum, in a, to a circumstances. And yes, no vote, no voice. <laughs> Politics is important. It's important, guys. Yeah.